Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, finally, the weather is nice in here in Iowa. It's 51, finally. Anyway, uh, today I'm working on the Honda as I promised before. We need to figure out what's the, why it's having a, a check engine light, why you have misfire in it. So a few videos ago, I made this lovely device. It's a homemade DIY uh, smoke a machine to test to run smoke uh, through intake or exhaust or what have you. Uh, basically, we'll give this a try. We'll hook it up to the intake from that port in there from the brake uh, from the brake booster, and the air source is going to be this uh, hand pump because you know I, I, you know it's on the side of the road. I have no air compressor or anything, so we got to figure out a way to inject air in here. This has already been hooked up to the power. Uh, smoke's already ready. Just we need to hook up the uh, inlet and the outlet goes to the uh, brake booster so we'll take you with us we'll take you with us uh, through this journey and uh, basically uh, we'll see if it's uh, a vacuum leak or it's something else because my option is either a vacuum leak or an injector or fuel issue so welcome and let's uh, let's give it a try All right, so basically what I'm thinking here, this is the brake booster and a lot of people will hook it up to this uh, hose in here, but I don't have like the end that goes into things. So basically what I'll do is I'll take it from here, I already start loosening it up. So basically with uh, an plier, just take that thing off and basically wiggle around. Here we go. Now, let's see if my choice of the hoses was correct. This should fit right away here. Yep. So once we fit this in, what we can do is we need to hook up this to the outlet. So basically what I'll do is using the pump We'll inject air here in the inlet. I did a small upgrade than the last video. I just replaced the inlet style. Okay, if you know before, my actually my pump is broken, so it's barely holding up. Yep, not getting pressure. Okay. Because this has never been perfect, so let's double check in here, actually see if there is more coming out from this first, then we'll hook it up. Yep, my thing here is not functioning properly at the moment. Here we go. If there is any vacuum leak in the plenum, which is basically that's what Honda called the plenum, this area. So if there's any vacuum leak, we should see a smoke coming out of it. If there's no vacuum leak, we'll see it from the intake uh, side, whereas the aftermarket stuff that the previous owner uh, put in there. Yep, the dirty stuff there. So we'll keep injecting air and looking for smoke I'll, I'll make you my eyes guys here do you see any smoke showing up anywhere no more we 
see nothing so far. All right, so if there's no smoke, I'll just double check on my tool here is actually working. Just to make sure it's injecting smoke. Probably not. Let me see it. Yeah, this is tougher than what I expected. Okay. <laughs> so, by the way, guys, uh, camera here. Do you see this? This is. Don't don't buy this this uh, <laughs> uh, soldering iron. It's have a lot of empty spaces in here. So if there's too much pressure, it's going to push back here too. So it's making some smoke in here, but not the actual. But I mean, so far, aside of the smoke that's initially come from this uh, port here, I am not seeing any smoke coming, coming out uh, in there. So I don't think I have a vacuum. You know? there's smoke it should still show it up like that anywhere it doesn't need really need like a lot of pressure or anything but so far so good so it's not a vacuum leak so one of the things to keep out of the of the list so then most likely i have like a, an injector related issue so at least you know we tried this uh, in action and uh, as you notice here, I broke this weld. <laughs> so yeah, it's a good DIY uh, tool, but hopefully guys, you know how to use JB Weld better than me. <laughs> so this one broke, but so far, no, uh, no smoke coming out from any vacuum hose. So I don't think the issue I have is with vacuum. Uh, the next thing I will be chasing uh, fuel. I'll see if I can take the fuel uh, rail today. We'll do filming on that. It just depends on what the schedule is, what's, you know, free time we have and all that. Uh, and again, guys, thank you for watching uh, Newbies on Work on Cars. I hope you like the videos. If you like it, please uh, share, subscribe. Uh, tell your friends about this channel. And again, thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.